Now let's talk about our strike where we're boxing the air. So the easiest way to remember this is just two open palms, right? And when I teach this seminar, I tell people, you know that monkey with the symbol that goes like that? That's exactly what I'm doing to my adversary. So my hands are up like this, my hands are up still, I'm gonna take my palms and I'm gonna box their ears. Now, if you gently at home kind of go like this, you can see how you feel the pain, it kind of messes up your balance a little bit. Now imagine doing this to someone in a real fight. You're really gonna get away, it's a very effective strike to defend yourself. So when I'm in here, I come straight in, boxing both of my ears, his ears, with my open palms. Now, from this position, the best thing I can do is throw my thumbs into his eyes. Now remember, I want to get away. So if I'm here, I would box the ears and my thumbs would come to the eyes. So let's turn him just a little bit so you can see from here. If I box the ears, look at my opposable thumbs. They're perfectly made for this. Oop, and I push him back. Now we talked about my contacts. If I got something in my contacts, I can't see, I can't do anything. I just gotta like do that and get it out. If my thumb goes in his eye, I'm gonna be able to defend myself and he won't be able to hurt me. So now to practice the boxing of the ears with a partner, you need two mip pads. So from this position, he's just gonna turn his palms out just like that. My hands are up. I'm gonna take both of my open palms, come in in a lateral motion like this, and strike the pad. So I'm coming in here, in here. So you see how I come in, and then strike. Now, to remember to practice the thumb to the eyes, what I do is I just take my thumbs from here, press in, and push in to my adversary, or in this case, my partner. Okay, so watch this again. My hands are here. I box both the ears. I use my thumbs to push in. Now, if I'm nasty, we're going to get to this. I can take him and then throw my knees. So you can see how we're starting to chain our attacks or stack them together to make one effective self-defense technique.